and we're back to Memory Days Sim Date. We are now in the spring semester. Kai's birthday is coming up. Um, then it's Valentine's Day and a science test. Hmm, decent, decent lineup here. Um, I have eighty dollars, so I can afford whatever I want. Ooh, a cutscene. What's up? Nothing much. You? I was about to head over to the park. Want to hang out with me? Why not? Oh, that's a lot of energy. Hey, I just realized something. This is where we first met, isn't it? Yeah, you're right. Dot, dot, dot. I belong only to you. You'll meet me once, but never again the same way. You'll live life with me, dream about me, but when your time ends, so will mine. When am I? Okay, I'm gonna give like a good 10-ish seconds, like right now, it already started, for you to think about it before I will jump in and say memory. Do you remember that? Ha, <laughs> kind of. That was a long time ago. Did you ever solve it? Dot, 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 dot. It's a memory, isn't it? See, because it's called Memory Days, and ha, <laughs> ha, that's the theme of the game. Okay. Da, da, da. Yeah, it's a memory. A memory of when we first met that summer day. Oh, wow, could you be any more poetic? Wait, oh, I thought you were going to confess to me, but I have a boyfriend, so don't talk to me. Wait, perfectly pink rug, Saki plushie, Bob Star wall scroll. I'm not interested in any of that. Godmother the DVD, trendy t-shirt, and handy keychain. Hey, Kai, what did you think of the godmother? I'm just asking. This is totally unrelated to your birthday. Anyway, I should probably attend class. Wait, wait, when's your birth? Wait, it's Sunday. Every time. Every single time. Oh, okay. I'm gonna study in the library. Don't forget to attend class and make a study. Yeah, yeah. I'm rich, so I can... Oh. Okay. Let's see what um food they have available. Cola, sake salad, sandwich, and a combo meal. Um, I'm not saving up for anything, so I'll have a sandwich. That sure hit the spot, but it didn't hit the mood. I'll read a book. And then study. Oh. Yeah. Um. What do you think Kai would like? I'm gonna see if I triggered any cut scenes. Oh, there you are. Kai. Oh, I'm not in the mood. I could break up with you. Oh, no, I don't want to. Wait, date? Oh, I should date him. Hold on. I'll think of presents for the both of them. Let's see. Godmother the DVD and a trendy t-shirt? Why not? Let's get both. Oh, right. I might as well, um, what can I do that doesn't require that much? Does hanging out at the lake? Yeah, it uses energy. Well, I don't want to go in a totally crappy mood, so there's an alright mood. I mean, we're still pretty moved down, but... Oh, that's the necklace from Haru! Oh, it's in our room now. One day, you know what that means. Kai's birthday is tomorrow. Okay. Um. Wait, what did I say I was gonna get for Kai? Wait, I don't even know what I have. Hold on, Ma will tell me. Okay, Godmother DVD for Kai, a trendy T-shirt for Haru. Right, right. Just stop doing this. Let's see if I trigger any cutscenes first. Oh, you're not wearing your jacket. You're not wearing your jacket either. Oh, here we go. Yo, where are you going? To the gym for basketball practice. It's the first meeting of the season. Can I watch? Sure. Oh, energy. I've always seen Daichi as this fun, laid-back guy. I think I've grown to like him for his energy and positive attitude. But today, I saw a whole new side to him. He usually smiles at everyone as if he was their close friend. All right, on that court, he gave all the other players in this stern, focused glare as he charged across the floor. This Daichi I saw today was not the same Daichi I knew. 
yet somehow I became even more drawn to him. Hey, hey, remember who your boyfriend is, I. Man, I'm tired. So you weren't bored watching, were you? It looks cool. <laughs> thanks. I'm not really that great, really. I just play for fun. Well, I guess some of the guys on the team kind of don't like me for that. Some of them take basketball pretty seriously. Doesn't that bother you? Hmm? What does? It doesn't feel good to be disliked, right? Talked about. It's hard to not care about what other people think. I remind myself that I should only worry about my friends. But actually, I think I only really care about what you think of me. Oh shoot. No, 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 no. No, back out. No, 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 this is, this is not what I was anticipating. No, don't, no, does this count as cheating? Oh god. What? Do you like me? Huh? Lately, I've been able to get you out of my head. Am I no good? Wait, I... I like you. A lot. What do you think of me, I? Sorry. <laughs> this is the most awkward thing. Here I was talking about how, man, it sucks when you like someone but they're dating somebody already. Welp, I just pulled that on Daiichi. I didn't... As soon as I say... If I say I like you too, I go back to... I am at the point of no return. These relationships won't stay the same. He'll no longer be a good friend. Sorry. Oh. I'm really sorry. What's that? Hold on. And we're back to Memory Days Sim Date. We just, um, rejected a guy because we were dating another guy. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, it's fine. It's not fine and you know it. I, I'm sorry too. Yeah, you better be no don't no. Why did I have to attend your cutscenes? Let's still be friends, okay? That was a bit uncomfortable and awkward. I think it would be best if we didn't talk to each other for a while. Yeah, I don't know what that is either. What the heck? What? <laughs> Sorry, that was my brother. Oh no! Oh no! He's not our good friend anymore! He's just our friend! No! Wait. What? No, that's my bag. It's my bag. Okay. Darn. Leave. That was super duper awkward. Okay. Why don't we go on a date with, um,. What's his face? Haru. Let's date. Sure, I'm free. Should we go now? I'm ready. Oh, do I need to wait? Wait. Did I need to bring a pre? Oh. Well, I. I wasn't um expecting that. No cutting too. Okay. Let's attend class. You're doing well in class, just don't forget to study. Oh, well, we need to do a lot more studying for this science test. Wait, tomorrow's Kai's birthday. Okay, it's not Daiichi, it's just Kai. Okay, cool. Let's go to sleep. Oh, they put a picture of your date. Okay. You know, I should probably do an extras episode or something where I get, like, everything in your room and you can see how decked out your room could get. Um, wait, it's whose birthday? Oh, everything's getting ready for Valentine's Day. Wait a minute. Valentine's Day doesn't happen in the spring. Okay, Kai, where are you? You're in the cafe. No. Oh, they dress up like little kids. In the mall? No. Cinema? Oh, God. It's so gaudy. Oh. Hi. What are you doing? Just reviewing my notes for the science test. Um, w would you like to study together? Sure. So what do we have to know for this test? Everything about the formulas. They'll let us a sheet with a list of them. Oh, good. So we'll only need to know how to do them. Da, 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 da. Huh? Where's my pencil? I always have one with me. Maybe I dropped it. 
dot 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 dot. You can have one of mine. Really? Are you sure? I mean, you gave me a necklace, but I'm not going to second guess that. But letting me use your pencil, that's a whole new level. Yeah, uh, of course. Thanks. You're welcome. How many more relationship points can we get with him? Okay, if we studied, that means I should be totes ready for that test. But I'm looking for Kai. <gasps> you should get the Godmother DVD. Happy birthday! Huh? This is for me? Of course. Thank you, I. Wow, today really is a happy birthday for me. Thanks for making my day. Oh, you're you're welcome. Um, you're still a good friend. Stay there. I'm gonna move Daichi up to good friend somehow. Somehow. Can't believe we stayed friends though. Okay, wait. How do you use the library? Yeah, yeah. Park, lake, hallway, classroom, cinema. Okay, yeah, we already. Okay, should I work or study? Wait, when's the test? Okay, how about I attend class, and then it'll tell me. Here you believe answer. Okay, we're ready. Then I'll work. Ten dollars. Wait, let's see if I want anything. Oh yeah, like I said, I don't want anything. Okay, let's go. Wow, we're just zooming by these days. Today is nothing. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. I should probably get a gift. Uh, if you heard my brother belch in the background, he's pretty rude. Right, AJ? He says right. Okay. Um, who would Haru want? Handy keychain. Oh, I don't think it would matter that much. Um... Let's see what kind of movies there are. There's his day off. Mr. Stu goes to again. Gone with the rainbow. Oh, that's um Marty Stu, I think that's his name. And Prince Dreamboat. And they have like this amazing weird relationship and Mr. Dreamboat is like the dreamboat of everyone, but he chose to stay with the plain ordinary guy like Marty Stu. Maybe it is Gary Stu, I'm not sure. See, like, that's that's probably Gary Stu, and that's probably Marty Stu. Or that's Marty Stu, and that's Gary Stu. I don't know. I want to watch Gone with the Rainbow. That's, that sounds funny. But I don't... My mood's already really high. So... Oh, hey, cutscene. Hi. Are you free right now? Yeah, I can hang out. Oh, wait, that might have been a bad decision. What if he confesses his love to me, too? Oh, no. Oh, no. Sim girl date problems. Want to get some ice cream? Sure. Oh my god. Are you okay with these flavors? Actually, I like your ice cream better. Because I don't really like chocolate or strawberry ice cream. I know, I know. Call me a heathen or something, but I don't like chocolate ice cream. Oh no! Okay, we're back. You okay with these flavors? Yeah, thanks. Oh, good. Save the better flavors for yourself. Hey, I've been wanting to ask you something. Yeah? Oh no, 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 no. So why did your family move here? Okay, that's fine. Oh, my dad's work. He got a new job in this city. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. I lied. I. What? That's not what I've been wanting to ask you. Damn it! I was, I was like, gonna be like, oh, you just wanted to know that? No, 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 you wanted to know more. It wasn't? I'm going to be straightforward, okay? Will you marry me? What? <laughs> Thanks. Will you marry me? <laughs> oh my god. Yo, he just asked if he could marry me. Oh god. Oh, don't, I doesn't even say anything. What? That's my line, isn't it? No no no. That didn't come out right. I I meant Will you go out with me? 
Oh, it's really tiny. He actually meant just will you go out with me. But next time, next time. Okay. Huh? I can't hear you. Will you go out with me? Um, takes a barbecue so you could try something new. I'm sorry, you're nice, but I want more of the barbecue, but you can have it. Uh oh. Please don't take it personally. It's alright, I completely understand. You don't have to apologize. That was a bit uncomfortable and awkward. I think we lived. Oh, damn it. Two love confessions within two days. This is not. This is not working out. Look, now I have two friends and a boyfriend instead of all of you at good friend. Look at the like. This is a. There's a life lesson in here somewhere. I'm pretty sure. Okay, let's see if there are any more cutscenes. I'm pretty sure that should be the only one. We can date again. <laughs> that would be pretty mean. You know what? Let, let's just date again. Sweet. I'm not sure if that's doing anything or not, but... Yay! Normally dates are this complicated process where you have to give them two gifts, talk to them three times, or answer their questions correctly, and then you have to have their mood up, and then you go for the kiss, and then... This time, you just like, hey, let's just hang out with no pressure attached. I think that's beautiful. Say people are shopping as if there's no tomorrow, you earn two dollars. Yay, let's go. Wait, wait, make sure I have a gift for Valentine's Day. Wait, I should maybe get three gifts. This sounds really dumb. Um, two gifts. Oh, but if I pay for that, I'll just be broke. I'd rather not. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna sleep. Happy Valentine's Day! Yay! It's on a holiday, so. Ooh, you could ask people to be your Valentine. Why would I, like, not be my boyfriend's Valentine? Oh, it would be too awkward if we were to go to Kai, like, sorry, I'm liking that way. But will you be my valentine? Oh, that's it. Okay. Huh? Is this really for me? Of course. Oh, thank you. Oh, you're so nice. Wait, wait, I should probably study for that science test. Y yay. Yay, I didn't need to do that at all, whatsoever, but let's just work. You're not in the mood. Okay, fine. Let's go buy, let's go buy a sake sandwich. That didn't help my mood either, but, uh, maybe I can work in the movie theater. Busy, busy, busy. Today the theater was packed. You earned five dollars. Well, that was really lame. I could study again, but there would be no use. And I, I'm not in the mood to work. So, I guess I have to talk. I'm not gonna talk to these two until, like, summer. Um. Wow, I, I can't say. Okay, date. I'm not in the mood to date. I'm not in the mood to talk. Ugh, I'm gonna go read a book. Okay. We're good. We're good. Let's go talk. I got a new computer recently. My old one is really outdated. It took about 15 minutes just to boot it. We should exchange emails. Oh. This is kind of embarrassing, but I still have yet to get one. I'll give you mine once I get one. I don't still don't know what it should be. Okay. Oh shoot. That was the wrong answer too. Oh man. We don't know anything. Okay. Let's go to bed. Yeah. Yeah. Happy Valentine's Day. It's test day. I better head over to school early. If I'm late, I'll have to make it up. Whoop. Here are the results. Better cross my fingers. I passed. I'll have to be not of doing my work. Sweet. Um. Are you in the classroom? No. Are you in the hallway? No. Are you in the cinema? Are you in the mall? Are you in the cafe? Are you in the park? Wait. 
wait, wait, where are you? Oh, huh? Hi? Hi. What are you doing here? I, I was just hanging out. Mind if I join you? No, you, you can't. I don't mind. Hmm. Sorry, I don't know what to talk about. Just relax, will you? Uh, hmm. I like this place a lot. The only things you hear around the lake are the sounds of nature. I come here to blow off steam whenever I get into fights with my dad. <sighs> uh, I must be boring you, sorry. No, I'd like to hear more, if you're okay talking about it. Huh? It's not bad if I want to know more about you, is it? N no, it's... it's... <sighs> my dad... He has problems that make my family kind of complicated. His first wife, my brother's mom, left him a long time ago. He's still in love with her to this day. He's bad at letting things go. I guess I'm kind of like him. I can see where it comes from, but that's still pretty horrible. Yet he remarried. And then I was born. Oh. Oh, dear. My mom and I have an empty relationship with him. I can't blame him, though. He loved his first wife too much. That's why my brother, Akito and the Nora Cafe, are so precious to him. They're all here what he has left to remember her by. Even though I understand his feelings, we somehow get into fights all the time. And I always end up here, running away from everything. I'm a coward, aren't I? If I had more courage, I'd be able to tell him, Wake up. Let go. I know you loved her. I bet Akito loved her too. You're hurt because she stopped loving you, but don't burden yourself with that pain. Because Mom and Akito love you. And I do too. Thank you, I. For what? Thank you for giving me the courage to say that I. Next time, next time for sure I'll be able to say it to him. Just like that. But I'm, I'm glad. But I did nothing. It was all you. Maybe. Oh. Wait, I don't want to break up. Okay, okay. Um, I want to work. Fifty dollars. That's a nice round number. Now let's just keep talking to Haru. And this. I think bears are cute. When they're not being threatening, I think so too. They're pretty big though, aren't they? Oh man, I, I'm leaving in the best mood, even though Haru just told his complicated life story. Can I see a keto here? No, no. Okay. Let's go to sleep. Saturday. Where are you now, Haru? Da 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 da. How come? Okay, he's back at the lake. Okay. I had a weird dream last night. I can't remember exactly what it was about, but I know some someone how I know it was strange. Maybe you'll remember it later. Yeah, maybe. Oh, why do I keep seeing the wrong answers? The study session system is kinda of weird, isn't it? Though I guess it helps students actually learn rather than force them to cram info they'll forget the next day. I think it's a good thing. As long as we actually study, passing those tests is no problem. Go out like this sometime. I think bears are cute, and yeah, I don't remember my dreams all either. Oh, that's sort of ironic. They're basically a collection of her memories, yet we forget about most of them. That's not really true. Well, it might be, because scientists, I think, at least at the time of recording, and to my knowledge, don't really know what dreams are exactly. Some people, some scientists would theorize that maybe the dreams are like the brain purging information that it doesn't need. And that basically explains a lot about my dreams, because my dreams are pretty disturbing. Like, not kid-friendly, at the very least. And my brain would like to forget about that. I want to forget about that. So if I keep dreaming about that, maybe it's like purging it. Some people, mostly the new agey people, are like, hey, dreams are meaningful and symbolic and your brain is trying to tell you something more. It's the foreshadowing of your life. And 
like, I don't really believe that, but whatever, it could be that too. And Haru is saying another theory that it's like a mishmash of our memories. It's like a brain dump, or the brain is sort of just streamlining information, and you just kind of have some foggy recollection of what your brain was doing. Maybe it's improving your memory. I don't know. It's pretty interesting because I would look it up, but I'm a bit too lazy to do it right now. But it's very conflicting what scientists have to say about dreams. And one more time. Oh, same dialogue. Um, that's it for the end of spring. Everything went into full bloom. The flowers, the trees, and perhaps the love in the air did too. Oh, that's nice. Um, I'll stop the recording here, and then this should be the last session this summer.